what's up my sausages and um the music that you hear in the background um if you watched the last episode you'll know that um it's black sun i think 3788 please don't or please correct me if you get if you know what, I'm, I'm just going to have his um channel link in the description as well as dennis age 2010 two really awesome channels that um i am work working for slash with i guess and they're both really awesome and so um thank you um aaron for that um the music in the background i got permission from him to use it it's not like it's plagiarism or anything so yeah and um so i believe that we were fixing the um ren render it's pretty much good oh yeah oh yeah I, um i did it myself i forgot but um it's not a hundred percent done like does it no it doesn't do it there it doesn't do it there all right well i'm going into weight paint now uh right oh right i have to select all of these select this right click this and select here so what I'm going to do is bring it out there. Anything slanted, I will subtract. I only really saw it right here. Just in case, you know, some, some microscopic thing that I can't see. And I still don't know what the error is for this. It's probably something so simple, but I just don't know what the problem is. Um, again, if you know the answer to my problem, please, please, please tell me. Um, did I just fix it? Alright, um... Okay. I accidentally fixed it but now we have to edit it more so if we cannot fix this then um then um i think it's all right for now unless you know what the bloody problem is i just said bloody because i'm bloody freaking amazing <laughs> all right Uh, so I need to subtract that. No idea what the problem is over here. Alright, so what I think I'm actually going to do, leave it as it is, and if you know a, a better solution, just tell me. Wait. Nope, doesn't do anything. How about this? I fixed it! Alright, <laughs> okay, I fixed it, thank god, that was my number one problem with the game that I'm making. Alright, so I fixed that, and I believe that the weight painting is done. Don't you love it when things accident accidentally work out? Yeah, alright, so, um, you know what this means, Trethero? What are we going to do? We are uh, 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 going to start the rigging. Alright, no need for the drama. And, um, we are going to, um, be doing a, um, a walk animation. And I'll be starting the, um, walk animation from my memory. And then I will be, um, and, and then I will be changing it up um, accordingly. So, um, and also, if you're doing an animation, I always use Dope Sheet. And if I'm doing um, for games and stuff, um, game animations, I do Action Editor. So, we're doing a um, animation, so we're just going to zoom this in on the Dope Sheet. And because it's a dope sheet, um, 
um, we don't, we don't, we can't really have, um, just segments, saved segments of animation. So what we are going to have to do is, um, is just, if you want to repeat a clip, you'll just copy wherever it's from and, um, do it again. So, alright, and now what we are going to do is go to the bone, pose mode, select all, make sure you select all of the, um, bones. I'm actually going to turn x-ray on, I think I turned that off wrong one no wait over here here we go turn next around so select all of them yeah that's right I lock rot we uh, lock if you don't know stands for location rot if you don't know stands for rotation and scale is scale in case you didn't know wait is it scale yeah I have it it is scale, and we don't need scale unless you want to make a mecha creeper or something like that, or have the creeper, like, triple in size or something like that. So, I think we have it 30 frames a second, 24 frames a second. So that means, um, I'm actually going to make it, one, it's a little more high def, and two, it's easier to manage. Make it 30 frames per second. So from here to where this is now is one second. And that's very important for your, um, modeling. Or not modeling, you know what I mean. So, yeah. Uh, so we're going to move that. I'm actually not sure if this is how a creeper walks. But it's nice to experiment. And technically, if we, uh, just for the walking, we only need to select the legs. But just to be a little more organized, um, we're going to be selecting the whole thing. Plus, it's uh, good to get in the habit of doing that because you might decide on the next frame to go like this or this and stuff like that. Wait. Huh. So that's a little messed up. Oh, hold on. I just thought of something that we can do to fix that. Wait. Alright, so this I actually kind of like the feel of. Um, the independent head. But for our case, I do not believe that it will work. Darn it! We subdivided it. Oh well. It's good for now. Uh, yeah. I... Yeah, I, I don't think we can fix that unless we went, maybe, um, if we brought this down one, that might help. No, I think that made it worse. Oh, so, um, yeah, I'll fix that off camera, because I want to get this done. And so, let's see how this looks. Ah, oops. Hmm. Apparently it's not 30 frames a second. Frame rate 30. Oh, oh well. We'll fix we'll fix it up. So let's do every five frames is um one movement of the legs. There. So let's see how this looks. Yeah, that looks good. And we will select this, Shift D, bring it up to frame 10. Oh, and if you want to get um, precise with this, you can press X and that locks it in into, I think, every frame instead of just like the randomness. I just found that out um, 30 seconds ago. So, <laughs> yeah, in case you don't know. And so now we are going to, hold on, which way did we do it? So, that's back, so w that means that it's front now. Oops, we went up three, one, two, three. 
one, ah, uh, one, two, three, one, two, wait, no, yeah, this suddenly doesn't seem too right, yeah, that doesn't seem right. But I, I think it is. Oh no, it was wrong. Yeah, all right. Let's actually do it from this view. Not sure why we weren't doing that before. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Select all, lock rot, and now one more, copy the beginning, and let's see how this looks. And now what we can do is channel extrapolation mode linear, and so now, alright, besides that problem right there, what it does is, um, it, um, makes it so, um, hmm, did I do that wrong? Oh, wait, no, I, hold on, let me see if I did that wrong. Constant, that's what it is. And so, um, what it does is, um, oh, I, I see, if, if you look up here, we're, um, it shows the FPS, and it's going slower than it should, which means we should probably, um, make that double or something. Alright, I'm bringing this to 20. Alright, so right now, it's alright. And that does it for this tutorial. Again, thanks to um, Aaron for these, um, this slash these songs. I don't hear it right now, so, um, yeah. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to be putting in. And... Thank you guys for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe. And bye.